Why Tom Cruise and Brad Pitt Hate Each Other Celebrities are paid to create drama for their audiences, but sometimes that tension seeps into their real-life working relationships. There is no lack of reasons certain A-listers do not get along, ranging from creative differences to clashing personalities, and occasionally to the surprise of their co-stars as well as the general public. There are many reasons why they do not get along. For instance, it would make sense for Tom Cruise and Brad Pitt to get along. After all, they're both accomplished and beautiful actors who have shown their endurance in a profession known for quickly burning through talent. However, except for these fundamental similarities, the two individuals couldn't be more different from one another. Hello everyone and welcome to another video on our channel. In today's video, we're going to discuss why Tom Cruise and Brad Pitt hate each other. Yeah, you heard it right. So let's start our video. The competitive natures of both Tom Cruise and Brad Pitt are a source of tension in their relationship. An insider in the entertainment business told the National Enquirer in 2019 that Tom was the most prominent A-list name of the 1980s, and Brad was the biggest A-list name of the 1990s. Despite this, the animosity between the two parties goes far deeper than a friendly rivalry amongst fellow stars. According to Radar Online, their feud has lasted for at least 25 years. How did the beef between Cruise and Pitt begin in the first place, and what exactly is it about? Out. Brad Pitt landed a starring role in the 1994 horror film Interview with the Vampire opposite Hollywood megastar. Tom Cruise, because of the acclaim he received for his performance in the film Thelma and Louise, which was released in 1991. However, it was clear from the beginning of their exchange that the two did not share the same viewpoints. Pitt admitted to being miserable on the film set, despite portraying a brooding vampire in the picture. This pushed the melancholy tone of the movie to an all-new level and we were working with Cruz did not help matters at all. In one interview, Pitt reportedly complained, he bugged me. Your tango was the source of this information. During filming, there came a time when I started feeling a lot of resentment toward him. He's the South Pole and I'm the North, Pitt continued, elaborating on the differences between the two individuals. On the other hand, I could accidentally run into you while he constantly offers you a handshake. There was an underlying sense of rivalry that made it difficult to have any meaningful dialogue. Even after production concluded, Pitt and Cruz could not put their disagreements aside and work together. In 2009, these two actors were engaged in a fierce competition for the title of the actor with the most successful box office smash with their separate World War II dramas. Pitt appeared in Inglorious Bastards, while Cruz featured in Valkyrie, and ultimately Pitt's film emerged victorious. However, he was not gracious in his triumph and referred to his competitor's unsuccessful film as a stupid movie. However, his agency afterward went on record to refute the comment, saying that it was inaccurate. If you're enjoying this video so far, please hit the like button and subscribe to our channel if you haven't yet to show your support. Now let's continue. When Pitt's ex-wife Angelina Jolie became involved, the animosity between Tom Cruise and Brad Pitt intensified. In 2010, Cruise was in contention for the central part of a CIA agent turned spy in Salt. However, Jolie pounced on the opportunity to claim the role for herself. The director of Salt, Philip Noyce, emphasized to E! News that although Tom Cruise was never officially contracted for the role, he was seriously considering accepting the role. Because we needed to get started immediately, we had to find an actor. The CEO of Sony Pictures, Amy Pascal, suggested to her team that they give the script to Angelina Jolie. It is unknown whether Brad Pitt had anything to do with the movie since he was married to Angelina Jolie then, but we can assume that he loved watching the drama unfold. Following Pitt and Jolie's divorce in 2017, Gossip Cop revealed that she and Cruz had secret amorous encounters. This came after tensions between Pitt and Jolie worsened after their split. It is said that the two got along famously after initially meeting meeting to talk about a possible film collaboration. Unsurprisingly, an unnamed insider said that Pitt was upset by the revelation and that Jolie was delighted that her new relationship was causing her former partner trouble. It's possible that she intended to make the situation worse by rubbing salt in the wound. Even though the rumors were juicy, it turned out they were not true. Regardless of the actual status of the circumstances between Cruz and Pitt, it is pretty evident that there is no longer any romantic feeling between them. 
So that's all for today's video. Tell us in the comments section what you thought of this one. I hope that you found this video interesting. If you want to see more like this, then please consider subscribing for more. And don't forget to give comments and provide us with your valuable feedback. We'll see you in the next video with some more interesting celebrity facts and stories. And until then, stay tuned.